The frustration stemming from parents. We should have also canceled school. To teachers. I have kids coughing. I have kids sneezing. It, it, it is frightening. And now to a member of the district's own board of trustees. I thought it was very irresponsible. And Trustee Daniel Ford believes the district is mishandling the coronavirus pandemic by keeping schools open. The boiling point reached today after she says she was not able to be part of a meeting to discuss the virus with CCSD superintendent Dr. Jesus Jara and health experts. And Danielle, even though you're in Las Vegas right now, you are speaking to me virtually, which you say is the same request you made at a district meeting happening today. But you say they couldn't accommodate that request, right? I pretty much said I don't trust that all you people are not carrying the virus. I wasn't able to be part of that conversation. But Ford says she got a call from the superintendent after the meeting. She says Dr. Jara is waiting on a go ahead from the chief of the Department of Health to close schools. Um, I absolutely do not think that we're being responsible as far as taking action to um, ensure that our schools are safe. This statement sent out today from the district says that schools will be open as normal come Monday, but that a short term closure has not been ruled out yet. But Ford wants steps to be taken now to keep students and staff safe. Having 320,000 students come together across the city and then disperse back into the homes of everyone is not a good idea. Ford also believes Clark County schools are staying open as long as possible because of grades and test scores. I don't really see any learning happening anyway, and I know that that is a lot of the reasons why uh, the decision is hasn't been made yet. Austin Carter, 13 Action News.